Hello everyone and welcome back to more Undertale. Last episode we fought some really creepy enemies or monsters. Um, they seem to be chimeras of other monsters that I guess Alvis, Alfie's was working on. And now we will go through this door. Why is there a snake? Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Okay, well, whatever. Seems to be turned off. I would have liked to read those. Seems to be turned off. Oh well. Hopefully they go back on because I want to read those. What the fuck? It seems like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on? Yes. What the fuck? Pause. No. Okay. Yep. I knew it. Hmm. Man, these are like it's taking a lot to I have to not kill these guys. Hey, stop! I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. Um, anyway, the power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seemed like you were one step ahead of me. This is probably just a big inconvenience for you, but, but I appreciate that you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated a power I called determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death, but the experiment failed. You see, unlike human mo unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take these concentrations of ter determination. Their bodies start to melt and, l and lost what physical physical physicality they had. Pretty soon, all the test subjects got melted together into those. Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much anyone was asking me. And I was too afraid to do any more work knowing everything I'd done so far had been a, such a horrific failure. But now, now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard, being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times when I screw up again. But knowing deep down that I have friends to f fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Huh. So, I wonder if I go back to places I'll see these fuckers. I mean, these guys were fucking scary. Don't I? Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden is something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder, what happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Oh, so she did make flowery. The flower's gone. Ring. It's a voice you have never heard before. Sujin, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Sujin, see you soon. Oh. Wow. Okay, well, okay, whatever. Just creep it out, why don't you? Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, it's, it's a flowey again. And this flower-ass fucking piece of shit. Can I just go up there? I can't save. What the hell? Oh, this, all of my save points are gone. Do I still have my items and stuff? Okay, let me put more stuff in my... Let's take the CT, ice cream, astronaut food. I said, no, wait. Put back. So keep the CD doesn't heal that much, so let's take that out. In and out. Star feeds a lot. Nice cream. Alright. Just case I got. Just case I got like fight Asgore again or something. <sighs> okay. What if I go to the car? Oh, oh. So, what I can't save? Come on now. Please tell me I can save. Come on now. There we go. Alright. I can't save. It's not letting me save. I was pressing A the whole time. 
<laughs> All right, the end. Let's do this ass score. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If, if by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. Let's go. I see. This is it, then. Alright, doing this again, I guess. Ready? A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You are filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. <laughs> what the fuck? Toriel! Oh, I haven't seen you! Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> what a miserable creature. Towing such a poor, innocent youth. <laughs> this is like how it started! <laughs> oh my god. I think I'm really happy to see her. I haven't seen her in a while. I was kind of worried about her. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel, your friend and guardian. At first, I thought I would let you make your journey alone, but I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous, and ultimately, it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You would have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So for now, let this let us spin this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Tori, Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul. Taken six. What? I think I read that wrong. Taken six souls from the humans, then come back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair. Because you would rather wait here, meek meekly hoping another human never comes. Tori. You're right. I am a miserable creature. But. Do you think we can at least be friends again? <sighs> no, Asgore. <laughs> His face! Oh, okay, okay, I wanted to get back together. Yeah, Asgore, human! Nobody fight each other! Everyone's gonna make friends or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I'm Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah. Nice to meet you too. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. <laughs> hey, nobody hurt each other. Oh, are you another friend? I am Torio. Hello. Uh, uh, hi. There's two of them? <laughs> hey, nobody fight anyone. If anyone fights alone, anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. <laughs> hello. Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst. Hey, human. Did that score safe? <laughs> Papyrus. And clone himself? <laughs> hey guys, what's up? That voice! Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh hey, I recognize your voice too. I am Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans, and uh, same. Oh, wait then. This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It is so nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie! I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am! This is the best day of my life! Hey, Papyrus, Hey, Papyrus. what does the skill and skeleton tile his roof with? Hmm... Snow-proof roof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles his roof with... Shingles! I changed my mind! This is the worst day of my life! <laughs> Come on, Asgore, it's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Y yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about the fish thing. 
sometimes you just gotta to uh stop going after furry blast monsters and uh just get to know a really cute fish it's a metaphor well i think it's a good analogy Oh my god, will you two just smooch already? The audience is dying for some romantic action. Hey, shut up! Man, the nerve of that guy. Right, Alfie's? Uh, Alfie's? No. He's right. Let's do it! <laughs> well, uh, I guess if you want to, then... Don't hold anything back. Oh my god, <laughs> the fucking faces. But wait! Not in front of the human! Uh, right. Sorry, I got a little carried away there. <laughs> My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you have made, I think... I think you will be happy here. Hey, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know to call everybody? Let's just say, a tiny flower helped- <sighs> Flowey, you fucking piece of fucking shit ass fuck, little fuck, fuckity fuck, fuck ass fuck. A tiny flower? A tiny flower? You fuck it, you didn't. Oh, okay, I thought he killed everyone. I swear to fucking God, Flowey, I will. You idiots! Oh, you guys were having a little powwow! I took the human souls! And now that I'm around those under my power, but all of your friend souls are gonna be mine too! <laughs> and you know what the best part is? It's all your fault! It's all because you made them love you! All that time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them. Without that, they would never come here! And now, their souls and their humans together, I will achieve my real form! <laughs> uh, why am I doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game! Oh, up, fourth wall. <laughs> just bring it before a wall now. If you leave the underground satisfied, you win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I hold victory in front of you just within your reach. And then tear it away just before you grasp it. Over and over and over. <laughs> I keep, I, I'm giving him a feminine hidden voice all this time. I keep trying to, I'm like reading the words, I'm not looking at his faces. Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you a happy ending. I'll bring your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that won't happen. You will. I'll keep you, I'll keep you here no matter what. Oh, uh, what? I can't. Okay, well. Even if it means killing you one thousand... I, okay, I'm really bad at numbers. One million times. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. <laughs> oh, fucking flowery. Oh, I thought I trusted you. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. What? 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 Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, you will always be there to protect you. That's right, human! You can win! Just do what I would do! Believe in you! Hey, human, if you get past me, you can do anything! So don't worry, you're wi we're with you all the way! Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on you. Oh, this is sick, I like this. Technically, technically, it's impossible for you to beat him. But, but somehow, I know you can do it. Humans, for the si for the future of humans and monsters, you have to stay determined. La la la, we're here with you too. Come on, you got this. You gotta win. You can do it, Ribbit. Oh, this is I like this ending. Okay. Urgh, no. 
Unbelievable! This can't be happening! You! You! Are oh, you fucking dick? <laughs> I can't believe you're all so stupid! All of your souls are mine! Oh, Flowey, you fucking asshole, man. I just kill Flowey. I mean, this is the best of us run. I just want to kill Flowey at the moment. What the fuck is this now? Oh wait, this must be a uh, Toriel and Asgore's kid. Am I like having a flashback or something? Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. So Toriel and Asgore's kid was a fucking flower? Was flowery? I mean, howdy. Howdy, Sujin. Are you there? It's me, your best friend. Oh. Asriel Dreamer. Hmm. I don't have a voice to give him. It's the end. What voice should I give him? <laughs> Can I spare him? Check. Asriel Dreamer. Infinity attack and finish me. Ledger baby made of every soul in the underground. Wow. I guess his fucking attacks are like infinity powered. <laughs> It's the end. Hope. You hold on to your hopes. You reduce how much damage you'll take this turn. This is getting trippy. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad! Ow. Okay, that was not bad at all. As well, charge this chakra break. I don't know what that means. Dream. You think about why you're here now. You can feel the empty space in your inventory get small. Are you... You know, I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Um, the fuck? This, that was, okay. <laughs> Ezra calls out Kazeos Saber. Do I have... Okay, cool. Oop. You keep holding on. Damage reduced. After I, after I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. I don't. Um. Okay. Okay. Um. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm just gonna heal. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. So if I die, essentially, I'm gonna have to start this fucking thing all over again. Fuck you, Azra with J, ready, star blazing. Hope. He kept holding on. Damage reduced. Then we can do everything all over again. Um, okay. That's really not all that bad. Yeah, except I got hit. As a is a guy of Buster. Okay, hope. Keep holding on. Damage reduced. And you know what? The best part of all this is you'll do it. You'll do it. Oh, um, hi. I don't exactly know what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, well, I'm gonna fucking die. I do recall it's not Chaos Saber. Okay, um, item. Vice. Popsicle. I said Popsicle! And then you'll lose to me again! Oh, you fucking. Yeah, stop! Mmm. Okay, well, we need something else now. And again. Am I supposed to be sparing him here? Because I'm not sure. <laughs> this is the fucking worst. I fucked up. Oh, jeez, okay. God damn, I'm gonna die. I don't wanna have to do that all over again. Come on now. And again. Um, excuse me. Fucking serious. I don't know what to do! <laughs> Let me just spare him this one time. Because you want a happy ending. Because you want a happy ending. Oh man, who doesn't? <laughs> no, come on! Oh my god, please don't let me have to start over. Oh, okay, cool. But it refused. 
It's the end. Do, do I have all my items back? I don't. Fuck. You want your hopes to reduce how much damage you'll take this turn. Oh, fucking. Let's just stand still or something. Fuck you! What? Cope. <laughs> it's actually reducing the damage, it doesn't seem like it. I don't know how to dodge this. Not everybody's galactic blazing. Oh, fuck it, just teal. Wait. Okay. Bicycle! Fuck you, Gaylord! Jeez! Mm. Dream. Because you love your friends. That's gonna fucking fuck my ass. I should heal with this, but I'm not going to. Hope. Because you never give up. Super ultimate hope, man! This is fucking... This is the worst. Oh my god. Okay, at least it's putting my hearts back. I just don't know if that's helping my case or not. Hope! <sighs> Jeez. Please stop. No, don't do it. Cause on chaos slicer. I can do with that. Hope you get up. Super high school hope, man. Oh fuck. No. Popsicle. What the fuck would he do this? Like these are his parents, dude. Mm, well, mom doesn't like his dad anymore. Fuck! <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> I was really hoping or uh, Toriel and Asgore would get together in the end, but that's just not happening. Oh shit! Mm. Yeah. Hope. Super high school hope, man. This fuck! <laughs> Please. <laughs> I keep fucking that up, dude. This, that really shouldn't be that hard. Uh, I guess I'll eat the star fate. Go drink it. Oh. oh. This one's so fucking hard. Dude, come on. <sighs> on your hopes. Star Spangled Blanger. Is that taking me back or something? I'm so bad with this, dude. Yes! This is the worst fucking one. I'm not even gonna do anything because this is wasting health items at this point. Oh, fuck me. Come on. Cut your shit! Oh, fuck. Ah, <laughs> fuck. As we know, you fucking flowy dick ass fucking stop! Oh my god, this is the hardest fucking thing. Chaos slicer, you hold damage reduced. Yeah, it doesn't help me though. That side is not that side. Fuck. I just gotta go like that, and we're good. Hope! No. No, fuck you! Yeah, 
shit. Okay, I got past that. I eat this astronaut food. Is that delicious? Your determination, the power that lets you get this far, it's gonna be your downfall. I literally don't know how to get past that part. I did it. <laughs> oh gosh. You're holding on, don't reduce. No. No, enough messing around. It's time to purge this timeline once and for all. Nope. Oh. Hi. Don't you fucking dare suck me up, you little piece of shit. Why the fuck are you calling my name anyway? That's what I wanna know. Oh. Even after that attack, you're still staying in my way? Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this! Um... I only have like one HP, so if you could mind fucking off, please. Thank you. Oh, there's more to this. Okay. I also see a dog. I don't know if that's a dog, actually, that's just a heart. Oh my god. I can't move. Struggle. Can't move your body, yep. <laughs> Yo, my true power! Oh, I can move now. And I'm dead. This <laughs> fucking shit! Can't move your body, I can't feel it every time you die. Your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Life will end here in a world where no one will you. So, if I... If I get... Every time I'm getting killed, technically, I'm... My friends are gonna forget me. Oh, world is ending. Wait, you can't move your body. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well the next life. Well, just considering how the fact you guys are, like, breaking the fourth wall, I don't know. God damn it. <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. Like, me personally, I'm, I'm fine. Also, I just realized I can't, I can't, uh, I can't use my items. Come on, show me what good your determination is now. I'm not getting. Can't move your body. Nothing happened. Your struggle. Nothing happened. You tried to re tried to reach your save file. Nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file. Nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But maybe with what little power you have, you can save something else. Save. Oh. Um. Uh. What? Mercy. <laughs> Fuck! I <laughs> thought that would work. <laughs> no! <laughs> Please! <laughs> oh, what is it? I don't know. Um, can I just save everyone? Oh, Sans, he's cool. You reached out to Azrael's soul and called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something was resonating. The lost souls appeared. What? Um, hey. Oh, uh. Joke! You told the lost soul a bad part about skeletons! You love it, but the other lost soul seems to hate it. <laughs> I must capture a human! Just give up, I did. Just give up. Oh, okay. Oh, that's sick! Okay, I love this. Alright. I'm loving this somewhat. You're not gonna use Santa fight now that I think about it. Lost soul stands there. Um. Puzzle. Recipe? Joke? Puzzle. He asked the lost soul for help with the puzzle. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Did everyone, did everyone will? Why even try? Hmm. The lost soul stands there. Um, fuck, I don't know. Insult? Puzzle? Recipe? He asked the lost soul to cook something for you. The lost soul is trying to hide its joy. You'll never see him again. Oh shit. I kind of use up all my healing items, so I can't really do anything here. Lost Soul stands there. Which one? <laughs> uh, crossword. You tell the Lost Soul you think that Jumble is together tougher than Crossword. It nods its head like it knows this without question. No, wait! You're my friend! I could never capture you! Now nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. You feel something faintly resonating with that Nazarel. Saved. Uh, Toriel and Asgore. In the depths of Azrael's soul, something resonating. 
Boss Hold appeared. Um, hug. Please. You hug the lost soul and tell her that you're going to see her again. Something about this is so familiar to her. This is for your own good. Forgive me for this. Oh, this is easy baby stuff. <laughs> so used to this, I can just do this like my eyes shut even though I can't. Um, Mercy! You refuse to fight the lost soul. Something about this is so familiar to her. No one will leave again. This is my duty. Not that bad. Lost Souls are standing there. Uh, pre preference? Oh. Um, hug. You hug the Lost Soul. It seems like its aggression is slowly melting away. Oh, what the fuck preference means? Probably. I think it's butterscotch fight. I think about it. Uh, mercy. You tell the Lost Soul you won't hurt him, no matter what. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. The jig is on! And uh, I the depths of battle. So also, these resonating! The lost soul appeared. Oh, I can't save Alfie's? Okay. Um, so, dude, fake it! We tap this lost soul lightly. Something about the way you fight is familiar to her. All humans will die! Uh, recipe. That's the lost soul to teach you how to cook. She doesn't know why, but she kind of wants to teach you how. You're our real enemy! Sorry, Undyne. This is actually one of my favorite ones to do, so I'm actually pretty good at it. I think. I, I can say that. I don't know about you. You will also a big smile like you remember she likes to do. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back! Well, some humans are okay, I guess. This feels something's resonating. Alfie is the best. I just show her anime and she immediately flips her shit. <laughs> uh, encourage. You tell the lost soul that you'll continue to support her. Something about the way you said that is familiar to her. You you hate me, don't you? I'm really not fighting Metaton. <laughs> uh, nerd out. You ask Lost Soul what her favorite cartoon is, she can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. I've got to keep lying! Oh shit, I forgot about that. Uh, dick, 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 dick! Alright. Uh, call? Quiz? Call. You call Lost Soul on the phone, she starts to sweat. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. No, that's not true! My friends like me, and I like you too! You feel your friend soul resonating within Azrael. I saved everyone, didn't I? Someone else. Strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began resonating within the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? 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 What are you doing? It's gonna be a long fucking episode. Feel your friend's soul resonating with Azrael. What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No, no, no! I don't need anyone! Um, no, please. Dude, 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 please, dude, boss! Stop it! Get away from me! Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart! Uh, boss? Boss, please. Boss, please! Boss, please! Boss, please. Sujin, do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? Oh. I'm doing this because you're special, Sujin. You're the only one that understands me. You're the one who you're the only one who only who's only who's any fun to play with anymore. Okay. No, that's not just it. I, I, I'm doing this because I care about you, Sujin. I care about you more than anybody else. 
Oh, dude. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So please, stop doing this and just let me win! No, fuck you. Oh, you dick ass piece of sh. No. Can you not? Stop it. Could you not? Stop it now! Can I, like, push forward? <laughs> Save. Sujin. I am so alone, Sujin. I'm so afraid, Sujin. Sujin, I. I. Hmm. I'm so sorry. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Sujin? I know you're not actually Sujin, are you? Sujin's been gone for a long time. Um, what? What is your name? Frisk? That's a nice name. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monster as well. <clears throat> they all care about each other so much. And they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Papyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are worried. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all really love you. <laughs> Frisk, I, I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I, I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. Wh what? Frisk, come on. You're, you're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all brooding with the same desire. With everyone's power, with everyone's determination, it's time for monsters to finally go free. Hmm. Oh, jeez, okay. Is that name? My, uh, so, ca I guess, canonly, my real name is Frisk? You know, I put the name Sujin. The barrier was destroyed. And break the fourth wall up my ass, why don't you? I mean, this game, this game was just like a giant fourth wall breaker. Frisk. I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people who love you. Oh man. Fucking game's about to make me cry, I swear. Oh my god, dude. You're you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye.
Can I move? Oh, by the way, Frisk, take care of mom and dad for me, okay? Oh, jeez, man. Frisk! This is all just a bad dream. Please wake up. Oh, you're awake. Thank goodness. We were so worried. It felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Yeah, you made Papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry! I don't cry! I just caught something in my eye. What did you catch? TEARS! <laughs> no, no. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? It'll make you feel better. Er, uh, how about we give them space first? They must be very- There's part of me as they now. The from what I'm not certain. Frisk, we don't- We do not remember exactly what happened. There was a flower and then everything went white. But now the barrier is gone. When you are ready, we will all return to the surface. It seems the door to the east will lead us there now. But before then, perhaps you might want to take a walk? You can say goodbye to all of your wonderful friends. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Hello, Frisk. Alfie's upgraded my phone. I'm having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Sans, check out this- Sans, check out this one! Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the Queen has returned! And also that she's a huge dork! You two are two feet away from each other! Why are you texting? Were we not, Papyrus? We are texting for a good reason. Why is that? Well, because we're huge dorks. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of a bonehead. Ha ha ha! Wow! Those puns are even less funny coming from her! Then why are you smiling? It's a pity smile! <laughs> hey, Frisk. What's with that weird expression? Sans, didn't I tell you about the time Frisk flirted with me? And then I asked to call me mother? <laughs> Are you bringing that shit up now? <laughs> oh boy. Wow, Frisk. This really puts our relationship in a new light. <laughs> hey, Tori, do you have any other embarrassing stories? Oh, do I ever? Oh, do I ever? But I think that story is one of the most unbelievable. It's hard to think anyone would want to flirt with me. <laughs> oh, Toriel, you have no idea. So, Asgore, how about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal Guard anymore. What? Then what was the point of this human's quest? They journeyed all that way, and I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard! Truly, this is the worst possible ending! <laughs> so, Alphys, what do you want to do now that we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. Well, of course I'm going to go out and, um, no, I should be honest. I'm going to stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. <laughs> That's the spirit! Everyone, a celebration to being losers! <laughs> the Paris is the right idea. Losing to Frisk is the best thing that ever happened to me, so I'm glad that we... Huh? What is it, Asgore? Um, what's an... Anime? <laughs> oh, oh my god! Frisk, please, help me explain what an anime is to Asgore. You see, it's like a cartoon, but... With swords. So it's like a cartoon, but with swords. Golly, that sounds neato! Where is this? Where can I see the anime? <laughs> Hold on, uh, I think I have some on my phone. Here, look at this. Oh, uh... Um, that's the, that's the wrong, uh, never mind. Was that who did it? Was that fucking hentai? <laughs> Golly, were those two robots kissing? <laughs> Boy, technology sure has something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it sure is. Howdy, Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about it. I hope we can still be pals. 
Hey, don't worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. <laughs> Asgore, that's not what I meant! Alright, um, let's see. I'll save here. Alright, I'm gonna end this episode here. It's been pretty long, and it's, I might, I don't know if I'll be able to record a little bit. I probably should get a terabyte drive first and put all the stuff I've recorded on that because the computer I'm using is getting kind of filled, but I want to thank you all so much for watching. This looks like it's about the end of this really wonderful journey of Undertale. I mean, this game is holy fuck. I mean, I, I mean, I felt fear. I felt cry. I mean, I was dying. I was laughing my ass off this whole fucking time. This is a really great game. Um, so, well, next episode will be the last. I'm gonna go about. I'm gonna go around and talk to everyone. I, I guess I've met on this journey. So, please like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you want to see more, and, you know, leave a comment about what was your favorite moment, actually. I, I mean, I haven't said this before, but I would like to see a comment of, just, if you've played Undertale, I really want to know what was your favorite moment in this game. Um, this game is just absolutely amazing to me. Um, anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace out and stuff.